The most important thing you could possibly learn is making a brush stroke because that's nothing, uh, everything proceeds from that. So making a brush stroke involves holding the brush, uh, the back of the brush with, you know, this, this way, where it's resting on your middle finger and your first finger just hangs out. And a brush stroke you make with your entire arm, your fingers, your wrist, elbow, doesn't really move at all. Yeah, it's just a brush stroke, a brush stroke. See, your arm moves from the shoulder, nothing else basically moves. And it begins and it ends on the canvas with uh, the same pressures. You make a brush stroke, it ends, make a br ends, you don't flick at it or lift it off before the end. It's just got to even, pretty even pressure. And so that, that's, so make brush, instead of blend, blending is something you do with your fingers and wrist like this and blending, blending, blend, which is a different school of seeing people who work that way get very smooth blending. They see life that way. Uh, so pa painters see life differently. So to learn to paint, of course, you have to think like a painter, which means pieces of paint. You're putting down pieces of paint and trying to make each piece of paint descriptive, as I was saying before. So not carelessly, if you know you feel the form goes, you try to describe it with a brush stroke. The form goes this way, the tension. Whatever it is, you're trying to describe something specific with each brush stroke, so each brush stroke must be specific. Whereas if you're doing this, nothing is specific. It's like a run on sentence, never ends, never begins, it's just. So, but as I say, People who paint that way see the world a particular way. People who paint with brush strokes see the world differently. But <laughs> there'll be a test. Um, anyhow, so, but the most important thing is each brush stroke is finite, begins and it ends because it's describing just so much. There's no run on, the form keeps changing direction, you can't do this because there's a lot of things happening. So each thing you have to see as a specific piece of business, 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 you understand? So then you start, your brush stroke helps you see more specifically and making good brush strokes helps you see more specifically. Seeing more specifically helps you make better, better brush strokes.